Hello, today we will make an Adobe Premiere video, your first video. So, open Premiere, click New Project, and type the name First Project. Click OK, and then write your sequence name. OK, without modifying anything else. And now, this is the program. In the lower left corner, you see this, this little window. If you right click and select import, you can go and find your videos wherever you save them and your music and uh, click open when you select them. Now you can see them here in this window and you can drag them into the timeline. It's telling me that the video you are trying to put in the timeline doesn't match the predefined settings. This is no problem. You just have to click change sequence settings and now the video will be just like your original saved video from your computer. Okay, now in the timeline you can see your video has been added. You can preview it inside the top right window. Okay, drag another video, just hold and drag. And now you can see we have a composition from one video to another. We see something else. The second video has an audio. It's muted, but we want to get rid of it. You see it's attached to the video, so we can't separate them. But we actually can. Right click on it and say unlink. And now you can separate the video and uh, the sound separately. Now delete the video with uh, select delete. Now you see this little bar here uh, you can scroll through the movie and uh, magnify it. The first tool from uh, the palette is for move. The second is uh, select everything after it. So uh, as, a, as you saw, if you click on the first uh, video, it selects the second. If you click on the second video, it uh, only selects the second because it's last. Now this tool allows you to make your videos faster or slower. Now the razor tool here, razor tool or C, you can cut, you just click where you want it to cut and uh, the video is cut. Now you can delete those parts or move them or do whatever you want. You can see, uh, you can do this for the second one. Let's make a multi-layered composition now. We can cut the second one and we can take some pieces and put it on video two. Now, you see, we are making a more complex composition here and we can select them and uh, put them back together. Now, we, if we hit play, we have the first on the stack, the video 2 showing first, and then the video underneath. Now, we dragged the sound. Now, you heard it. To make a title, go to title, new title default still, enter a name and hit OK, click on the T, drag a box, adjust your font and your size and write something, let's say hello world. Styles you have at the bottom, you have some styles, just click them with your text selected and they will show. You can uh, change the color of your text right here. Let's choose a blue something. Uh, no, blue. Okay, click it again and select some bluish color. Okay, you just, when you're finished playing with it, you just close this window and it will be saved. 
now you can see it here hello world you have the text and uh, you can just drag it in video 3 to place it wherever you want you can uh, cut it you can stretch it you can do whatever you want okay so you, you can see it in the preview that it works let's stretch it a little bit and that's it we can now save our composition go to file export media now in this window we have to change to h264 and uh, youtube uh, HD this is okay the output name you can click here and change the name and place where you want to save it and then you just click um, export you can also change the part you want to render from your video with these sliders after you're finished just click export and now the video is being encoded you have to wait a little bit okay almost done and now this is our video wait for it Tana, hello world we have cookies okay so this is it hope you enjoyed my tutorial see you next time <laughs>